Hi guys, welcome to CA Inter MCQs. We are on the chapter of labor costing or employees cost. Now this chapter is all about how to be paying the workers, what makes them motivated, which all departments are there in a company to take care of the workers and so on. Okay. These MCQs are designed under the new course. So therefore you all know the logic of everything as in exams, you might not be asked the same MCQs. So you'll be able to answer any twisted version in case you know the logic of each and every MCQ, which is there in the module. In beginning, I'm doing all the MCQs which are there in the module. Once that thing is done, then we will shift over to the other kind of MCQs. Okay. Which I have curated myself. So therefore, like, you know, the students can be getting good database of all these things. Also I advise you all to join our telegram channel. And in case you want a crash course or the regular course, you can always call us on the number that is given in the description below. So let's start it off guys. <coughs> the question. Idle time is the time under which, okay, get me the four options, please. Full wages are paid to the workers. Okay. B, B is no productivity is given by the workers. C, both A and B and D, none of the above. Try to think of the answer. Easy one. This is easy one. Okay, put that in the comments below, please. So idle time, idle time in this case is what idle time means workers are present in the factory, but they are not working and management is paying for this time. Example, workers were working, electricity went away. Company will still have to pay the workers. They are waiting for electricity to be coming. No, suppose there was a breakdown of machines. They were working. Suddenly the machine became bad. It stopped to be functioning. Workers will still be getting paid as such. Okay. So therefore, in this case, uh, idle time is something for which full wages are paid to the workers. A is correct. B, no production or productivity is given by the workers. So B is also correct. So out of the four, I guess C makes maximum sense to me. So C should be the correct answer. Yeah, that's the correct one. Thank you.